Hey, 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 hey. So I have the uh, PR package for GBFKE. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to think about it every time I say it. Um, and yeah, I'll just get started. I'll have the links. So, um, oh, move, honey. Move, honey. I'll have the links to three of them um, in the description box below. One of them got changed out for a another one. I'll see if I can find out for the one that got switched. I'll see if I can find the link for the one that got switched out. And then the second one, um, I had ordered it as a 30 by 40, uh, and it came to me as a 40 by 50, I believe. I'll have to look in just a second. Um, but the link I had chosen or the canvas I had chosen to start was 30 by 40. I clicked on the 30 by 40 link and, um, it doesn't work. Um, so... And then um, another one of the links didn't work too. I think it was the B one that um, I wasn't able to get didn't work either. So I'll leave the links to the ones I can, um, that I can leave links to. And then um, there will also be the link to the website and a link to their uh, Facebook page. So go check them out if you so choose to. Prices are pretty reasonable, I feel. Um, I chose mostly smaller ones because I I wanted to get them done in a more timely manner because it was for PR. Um, okay, so this one was the thirty was supposed to be the thirty by forty. Um, what does this say? 40 by 50, yeah. So, this one that was titled Cookie Bat Cow. Cookie Bat Cow. Um, and it's linked and it work anymore. I haven't opened it up. Hopefully it's okay. So yeah, it's supposed to be 30 by 40, came as a 40 by 50. Um, looks like drills are in Ziploc bags. I have to stand while doing this, otherwise I can't see what you're seeing. Uh, I just have to have the camera up so high. I guess I should check to see if it has... No, it doesn't. Um... Do I have my Sharpay here? I'll just have to keep them together. Okay, I'll just have to keep them together. So this is the Cookie Bat Cow. This one's a vertical one, so I apologize. Hmm. Because it's bigger, it's going to be harder to show. Oh, there we go. Okay, there's less glare. I'm hoping the colors... That's kind of weird. I wonder what this is, if it's like a curtain, but this is an otter right here. I'm thinking that maybe this is a window with window blinds, and maybe it's a curtain that has the image of an otter. If it's not a curtain, it's going to be a little bit weird. I probably wouldn't have gotten, I don't think I would have gotten a 40 by 50 of this particular image. Because, <laughs> you know, how bad do I want something this large on my wall of a goat eating cookies? <laughs> probably not super bad, but. Um, so, yeah, I think it's really cute. I'm a little bit worried with how dark the horns are, and the, even the cookies themselves seem super dark. Hopefully, um, I don't want to take them out because I can't ever get them back in, but, okay, I do see, 
I was wondering, I was like, is there even numbers printed on the bags? There are numbers printed on the bags. They're just all facing a direction to where I can't see the numbers from the outside of the sleeve. So, yeah, I'm hoping, I'm hoping it'll turn out okay, but just by the render, I'm not feeling super confident at this point. It could be a totally different story. It obviously looks better through the camera than it does on purpose person, but um, hopefully, yeah, hopefully it looks better once it's done. But I'm not sure if I'd want to hang something this big of a goat on my wall. I don't know. Okay. So here is the next one. This one does have a working link. Uh, this one is called White... Oh, honey. I thought you out not that long ago. You need to lay down. Uh, white snake with flower. Or white snake and flower. Maybe. White snake. White snake. Oh my gosh. Speak English. White snake and flower. Yeah. Okay, this one's in the Ziploc baggies again. The drills. Um, if that's something that matters to you. This one is a 30 by 30. I usually don't measure canvases because I don't care. I just assume that it's not going to... Uh... Twenty four point five centimeters, almost twenty five. Honey, you just want to go out to eat dirt. Okay, sorry about that. It's very pretty. I'm always this is not does not look like any real species of snake. <laughs> Even white snakes, it does not look like a real snake. But, you know, I'm always looking for um, reptile -y things. I'd love, you know, like a reptile stamp set. But, um, yeah, I have not found a realistic one that I like this far. Anyways, I just need to shut up. Uh, I wish there was, so its whole head is basically a white color block, and I wish that there was some detail in the head, because snake heads are not completely smooth on top. You know, you can see, they may not be scales that lift up like on the body, but you can see definite plates, you know, on the head. I don't think that's the technical term for it, but you can definitely see scales on the head, you know, and the snake is void of that. So kind of has the head shape of a, a python. But yeah, hopefully it's pretty. Um, hopefully the flowers turn out okay. I think they'll be big enough where they do turn out. But yeah, if you like snakes... This one may be a little challenging for me. I've noticed I don't mind color blocking black or dark colors. But after if I have to color block white, it's for whatever reason, it doesn't make sense, but that has been torturous for me. When I was doing that uh, flower mandala one. Okay, this next one is a 35 by 35. It is called Leopard, but is not a leopard. Uh, this one does also have the link. And there's going to be some white color blocking. I just set myself up this time. Didn't I? It is a cheetah. The only big cat that I am obsessed with. The cheetah. 2015. This one has the tiny bags, if that's something that's very bothersome for you. And here is the cheetah that is called a leopard. Okay. 
Um, this one is 28 centimeters. So quite a big border on this one. Still big enough that I think the image will come out good. I think. But yes, there is the cheetah. If I didn't say it in the start, uh, this was a promo package and it, it it will also say that in the title <laughs> too. So thank you, GBFKE. Um, yeah, I like it. It looks good. It looks good. That white color blocking is going to suck balls, but I did that to myself. Um, I like the colors. I really do. The colors on the drills don't seem as vibrant as they do on the canvas, but I mean, I'll just have to see. I'll just have to see when I do it. I'll have to see when I do it. So there is the leopard. That is not a leopard, it is a cheetah. Very pretty. I really like that one. I like the white border. I just, don't, I'm not eager to do <laughs> the border. I don't know why. I don't, I've been asking myself why I had, why it was so painstaking for me to do like the white around that uh, flower mandala one that I had done before and why I'm working on that huge maze one that has so much black. It's not funny. And yet I don't feel as stressed by working on the giant maze as I did that small mandala. I don't know. I don't know. All right, this next one is called Sonic the Hedgehog. You're probably really guessing as to what this next canvas is going to be. The link to this one also did work. It is Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> uh, tiny bags again. We were we were. Uh, Starting out on a high note, we're going to a, ne a less a less high note there. Yeah. I wonder if that's gonna be enough reds. There's two different reds that I see here. There's like a more brighter primary red, and then like a um, it's not a crimson, maybe like a mauvey red. Looks like there might be two packs of the mauvey red, but the the primary red is what most of the lettering is. I wonder if there's going to be enough. We shall see. Um, there's 19 colors, which honestly surprised me because in the picture it, it looked like just all color blocking. And there is a ton of color blocking, but um, there's actually some shading, which I was not anticipating. Which is good. That's good. I just... Wasn't expecting it. Um, oh, this is 30 by 30. Or. Um, 24 by 24. So, yeah. Um, this may be a really good one for me to try multi-placing, which... I honestly really don't mind single placing. It's more of a, you know, I'm not trying to get something done super fast, but um, it's, I just like the monotonous of doing something over and over again. And so, but I may try multi-placing with this one. Should be fun. So there is Sonic the Hedgehog. And then the last one, I had chosen a, a bumblebee image, um, and it was this really big, fat, fluffy bumblebee with this big white stripe across this butt, and it was so cute. Unfortunately, they were out of stock on that. So I chose a different bee one. I don't like it as much, but it's still cute. I just thought the giant fluffy bumblebee. I like bumblebees better than I do honeybees. Um, it was cuter, so I'll probably be stalking the site because I actually would really like to to do the bumblebee. This is more of a honeybee. 
Um, I don't have the link. I'll try and find the link. I know I easily found it um, by just typing in B in the search bar. Uh, this one got folded. Not so great, but <clears throat> it'll work itself out. This one is in the Ziploc, so if that makes you happy, that makes me happy. Uh, this one only has 18 colors. Colors. Yeah, I'm going to have to straighten the plastic good on this one. <clears throat> so here is the honeybee. Hopefully you can see it's okay. It's supposed to be like a bee, and then it has a black background. And almost think of like a splatter of, paint, of yellow paint, but instead of it being paint, it's like a splatter of honey. That makes sense. It's a cute image for a honeybee, if you're obsessed with honeybees. I'm just obsessed with bumblebees. For those that need to know, um, this one is 34.5 by... Um, 20, four point seven. I like it. I'm going to check the stick on any of the canvases. I usually forget to. It's sticky. Sonic. Sticky enough. Um, leopard that's actually a cheetah. Very sticky. White snake, not the band. Very sticky. Cookie bat cow. Very sticky. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with all these. I do wish the goat or the cookie bat cow was, um, smaller. <laughs> it's so big. So big. I don't mind doing big. I just don't want to do that particular. <laughs> it's so big. Um, yeah, let me know which one you think I should do, uh, to show as a complete um, except for the cookie bat cow, I want to save this for much, much later. Let me know if you want me to do the cheetah, white snake, sonic, or honeybee. I'm kind of tempted to do either white snake or honeybee, but you guys let me know. Let me know which one you think I should do next. And, um... Yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Adios.